All right, I'm back with this week's Night Terrors, and we're going with issue one of Night Terrors. So let's start off again with Dead Man giving us a little bit of his backstory about basically every time when he went up for a trick and shit, he damn near was risking his life, and the crowd went wild when his ass got shot. Said that was his greatest performance and shit like that. But now he's a superhero and all this sex shit. Back to the real shit though. Insomnia got his ass fucking by the neck because he's in Batman right now. He like, I'm just like you. We spy on the living. I'll give her whatever you dream of, dead man. Dead man says, I thought you was a ghost like me, but you're not. I sensed you were haunting Batman, Superman, and Wonder Woman because you invaded their dreams. He said, you got me all figured out, huh? John D was so afraid of the nightmare stone that he hid it. But did he hide it in the waking world or within the nightmares of one of the world's so-called heroes? Motherfucking dead man kicks off him. He's like, bro, if you from the fucking dream world, how the fuck are you here? Who are you? He's like, oh, I can tell you. He said he's the god of nightmares. He can turn, not only can he turn his worst fears into reality, but also yours. You see these motherfuckers pop up. Dead man jump out of fucking Batman's body right as he got done fighting these motherfuckers to fucking go jump into his body to see what the fuck he really is. So we get the backstory of the night, uh, Nightmare Stone. The Nightmare Stone created long ago by a sacrifice, a tormented hero and a long lost case. Dr. Destiny used to uh, possess the Dream Stone. John D. stole it and manipulated it into something broken and twisted it. But he feared the Nightmare Stone and hid it. You've been searching nightmares for any clues as to where it was and you started here at Arkham Tower. This isn't now, this is the past, a memory of a fort from your mind. The Lazarus Reign. Yeah, we found out the Lazarus Reign created insomnia. His powers don't come from nightmares. They come from that, the, uh, the rain shit. It gave him the ability to spy on people's minds as they slept. First, it was just other uh, inmates at, uh, at Arkham like Dr. Destiny. But then he started to spy on the heroes, but in their dreams, they are monsters. Why? And then he started to see something else, but there's more. Something you're hiding the light. A memory bur buried, buried away. I feel joy. He pushes his ass out, so the fucking dead man jumps back into Batman body. And just before uh, all the nightmares and shit about to get on fucking dead man, that's when this motherfucker jump out the window. And he said, just like old times, say what you want about Batman. But the dude works out. This is easily the most fit person I ever uh, possessed. I never really noticed because he hates it whenever I take over his body for riders. You see him take over the, uh, the fucking Batmobile to go look for clues as to find out how the way to stop this shit. Insomnia like, let that motherfucker run. Instead, I'm finna call up my sleeper nights. Go kill whoever in your way. You see at the bottom, he called the motherfuckers up. This is where fucking Dead Man found out that this motherfucker, damn near, he did it across the world and it's, uh, it knocked out nearly the whole world. There was a few heroes awake, like you got fucking Red Tornado because he's a fucking robot. Zatanna, she's awake right now. And he said he got his own, everybody got their own missions right now, all them heroes that is, but he got his own. So the shit happened because of fucking the Lazarus rain, and thank God. They said that most of the shit uh, got sw wiped off of the earth, which it did, but fucking Batman, of course, had a sample of that shit. As you see over in this fucking graveyard, the rain, and he says, but it feels a bit more, but I need to help and answer. Fucking graveyard fucking pop open and shit, and it was of a dude named uh, Wesley Dodds, hero mentor friend. And Dead Man goes to him like, look, the world is in danger. A lunatic has trapped the world inside their nightmares as he searches for something called the Nightmare Stone. It's up to the two of us to find out the truth and stop it. I promise you once we saw this case out, he said, say no more. 